Well, it's going to be a fruit and vegetable explosion at Fort Wayne's Farmer's Market tomorrow. Ken's here from Fruit and Plain Seeds to tell us what we can find and where. So the, it's tis the season, right? The produce has happened and there, I heard there's going to be corn tomorrow. Hopefully there will be sweet corn there tomorrow. Uh, it has been a very challenging year for sure, the sweet weather. corn. Mm -hmm. it was very, the soil temperatures were very cold early in the season and that has, there's been a lot of damage to some of the crops and it's just not been very conducive for them to grow properly. But hopefully we should have some sweet corn there tomorrow. There was green, uh, what, two weeks ago, I think, when I was there, there were green beans. I was super excited about that. Should have been. Yeah. Um, I'm just upset because I can't get there tomorrow morning because of basketball, those stinking <laughs> early games. I'm going to miss out on the corn. Well, because there is more produce and, and meat vendors like yourself, um, you guys have moved some of the vendors into the Diamond parking lot. We've got some pictures of, of how things have been going and then actually of that parking lot so people get an idea. Uh, Tell us what it's been like at the farmer's market the last few weeks. Well, last week was the first week we, were, we had moved a great deal of vendors out into the Diamond parking lot. Before that, we were out on the concourse, and the customers have loved it because yeah. we are so spaced out that it never really feels crowded, even when there are a lot of people there. So we like to take advantage. We want to try and keep people as safe as possible and uh, give them the opportunity to choose from as many vendors as possible. I would say too, uh, there are a ton of people, you can tell by the parking lot where people are parking, um, that there are a lot of people there, but I've never felt like I was unsafe, that people were crowded. There is a ton of room, such a variety of vendors too. You can find any, anything. Tell me what we'll find at Fruited Plain Seeds uh, booth tomorrow. Well, we specialize in naturally grown beef, pork, chicken, lamb, eggs, um, heirloom flour from heritage grains, and we are starting to go back into produce. So we will have some of that as it starts to become available from our facility. We can find all of it, all that stuff like that that's healthy. We can find the treats that aren't as healthy but are delicious. Uh, I also noticed there's there's flowers, there's handmade goods, everything that we need. Um, if we can't find anything, they've got a great host tent where we can go and ask our questions. Um, nobody is in, indoors, right? There will be about there are 15 okay. vendors indoors. There will be some set up under the overhang at the Lincoln okay. Financial Events Center. There will be a few on the corner street, but the bulk of us will be in the Diamond parking lot. It, 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 I guess, too, that's just one more way for people to be spread out. I do have a couple comments Lee had sent me. Um, People, these are what people are saying about it. They're saying the additional space between vendors helps with social distancing and makes lines so much easier at the booth. Somebody else said, I think you guys are doing a crazy wonderful job and want to thank you for all the hard work you put in. Um, somebody else said you've created such a safe space and environment for everyone throughout this challenging time. Um, I know people really appreciate it and it's a great way for us to get out, support our local farmers and get some great food. Um, as a vendor, what do you have to say about the farmer's market? The Fort Wayne farmer's market is a producer only market. So when you're buying something at the Fort Wayne farmer's market, it, you are talking to the people who grew it or made it. And that is so the important. reason I joined this market. Well, get there tomorrow, 9 to 1 at Parkview Field. We'll be right back.